Hey everyone, this is Chirag and welcome back on my channel. So today I would like to share about Alibaba Cloud professional security exam and I appeared for that exam last week and in this video I will going to share like what kind of questions you can expect and how you can prepare and uh, as we all know about security is always a key important thing when we talk about any cloud discussion any cloud strategy migration security plays a major role and Alibaba is having a two different certification for specific uh, security track so I appear for the professional one associate one is like an entry level I will plan to appear it for maybe in coming weeks but uh, I got an opportunity to sit for professional being as an MVP I got like uh, the internal exam system of Alibaba cloud so I thought that I need to take advantage of that opportunity and I started preparing from Hmm, almost I can say almost a month to exploring from the documentation to understanding because when it comes to the word professional uh, it seems like it will be the too tough exam but uh, let me set one thing I still feel like it is not that the professional tough kind of a criteria which other cloud providers are having or maybe because Alibaba is uh, having a three exam for each track like they have their expert track I have not appeared for any expert track yet but I already scheduled one of my cloud computing expert level exam in January month so I am expecting that that will be equivalent to some AWS Pro or Microsoft as your um, like an expert track so let's get started to talking about this exam which is ACP security so let me share my screen and uh, I will give a walkthrough that how you can expect the things just to share like this is the shiny certificate after passing the exam you will get and this is what I got uh, within few minutes so usually it will take if you register it for Pearson it will take at least a day or two it will appear in your registration account and you will be able to see and download and publish it on your social media so starting with this like you need to log in or uh, create a login or create your account and go to this edu.alibabacloud.com I will drop all the links in the description and coming to the certification professional uh, you, here you will see the different different tracks and, and uh, we are focusing on this ACP security professional so this exam is going to cost of $120 don't expect like this will get a free I know Alibaba is going to doing events and sharing the associate level, uh, uh, associate level certification free vouchers and every month so you can join the community I will also drop the community link it's a ding talk group and every month uh, from the Alibaba uh, employee they share about the schedule for exams and anyone can freely appear if you want to start your cloud journey and if you want to be comfortable but again exams are not just the end thing it is just a small starting point there is a lot of room to learn and explore so on this page you will be able to see like what to expect a little bit they are giving the buy now you can buy the voucher from here and apply it on peers and you can appear from home as well as from the center i appeared from home and uh, 100 is a full score and 65 is a passing score so they have like around 80 questions in this exam the distribution of questions is 40 will be the single choice 20 will be the true false and 20 will be the mcq and uh, here you can see you can download the exam outline and some sample question i have opened the exam outline and uh, you can read it here it is given like what kind of prerequisite uh, the one prerequisite that i is not required that you don't need to have an associate exam to appear for this exam you can directly register for professional level exam and start preparing it because if you don't want that you are comfortable with alibaba cloud you have already worked it on and you know about the concepts and logic and their service portfolio directly i suggest appear for the professional level exam but if you really want very new or you want to build confident confidence so then you can give a shot to the associate level exam so here it is given the content ratio as well as the question type i found that some questions are easy because if you really know about the general stuff the how the security matters and what kind of shared responsibility model you will be able to crack especially the true false section the 20 question i can say that is a full scoring quest, uh, full scoring section because i found it's it's too easy 
but it may happen depend upon your own experience like in which field you are working or if you are shifting from a different field to the cloud computing maybe you you will struggle so make sure prepare and understand your basics first clear your basics first and then it will it will be much much easy i'm not going to talk about how much score because i don't believe that we're getting a perfect score or lesser score will make any one thing it's about like how much your concepts are clear so don't run for the score yes passing criteria is there but i again want to put a focus and force on clarifying your basics because that will help after you achieving the certification the expectation from your organization or from your customer side uh, will be different that yes you will know the thing and you really need to know the things in a deeply manner because exams as i mentioned very specific syllabus but when it come to the actual architecture design and migration strategies there will be lot of things to know understand clarify consider maybe assume and then clarifications required how the workaround will be there so anti ddos let's start from there it is covering in a very well manner because alibaba is giving a two kind of one is a premium service one is a normal one there is something limitation that in the normal one how much the ddos uh, traffic can be uh, traffic can be managed from the alibaba side and that comes or you can say it is enabled by default but when it come to the premium there are lot of if and but feature you need to know about black hole so read about the documentation i will share the resources also and then web it's a layer 7 web application firewall and another thing i found cloud firewall which is you can say which work at the layer 4 or it can be kind of a, uh, a alibaba cloud first citizen but the equivalent of the third party firewall devices the industry is using be it palo alto or barracuda or checkpoint they all have their hardware in place but that is too much feature rich so that is where the cloud firewall come into picture you really need to know i was not expecting but i found couple of questions in the exam and uh, because of having the idea i was able to understand and able to crack and then security center this is really really tested in a much much deeper way because it is not just a central management location or understanding about understanding the account security or but there are many thing you need to know about the patch management how the viruses or brute force kind of thing can be mitigated so security center and you really need to play in your account to understand it the section in which i struggle it's content moder- uh, uh, moderation it's only here mention 5% but i found quite handful questions in the exam and uh, little little bit tip i want to say there are few things which is not supported in content moderation but maybe if you are coming from a different cloud provider you may assume that okay if the other cloud is supporting so alibaba cloud is also supporting but read it i i don't want to share what is the difference right now here because as it's a nda exam but there is something the catch is there so better read the documentation read the uh, what i can say the feature of content modernization and you can easily uh, achieve a good scores here ssl again the basic stuff alibaba you can purchase it from alibaba as well as if you can want to import your own you can do that you need to know the sequence that what kind of things required like private public key and whatever the uh, intermediate key so how it will work maybe if you have any kind of a ssl already purchased maybe try to uh, try to import uh, import in the alibaba cloud platform and it is again it is a one one of your practice as well as your scoring thing kms it's a key management system again alibaba cloud is providing the same software or dedicated uh, hardware security module as well as the shared one so need to know how the things work especially the sequence what are the customer master key and what is the uh, like how the envelope encryption working know the concept try it in your account and you will be comfortable it's not deeply tested but again it's a good uh, what i can say the good topic to know when it come to security and then has mentioned general knowledge about cloud security where you need to know a little bit about the network part and uh, how the network security group and all these things came, came into work and how it is providing the security feature and the last point which is again the mix of you need to know about the database and 
especially the uh, object storage service that how it is giving the security what kind of features are there so feel free to prepare or figure out or make your own plan like which area is your strong or in which area you need to put more efforts and then you will be comfortable again now coming to the same and uh, there is a course preparation it's like a one dollar course they are providing i can say little bit older content but still okay to understand the basics i believe the new content or of the updated content is coming soon but it is good you can spend time and learn about the concepts learn about like how the things are working and once it will be there the best thing i always say is alibaba cloud documentation so go through the things and see the product and once you will see the product see the security part here like you can see the different different scenario and read the documentation according to that some new services like this is i didn't find like this is getting tested or if the exam is going to updated in coming months maybe alibaba academy team will include the new content and uh, you just just have a look about this let's say i want to see about the mtd dos and just go to it go to the documentation mm -hmm. There is a, always I say the way to read the documentation so you can navigate from this left panel like what kind of thing maybe few topic you don't want to read or maybe you are already aware and then you can you can navigate easily and make according your plan that what will be required. I don't find that the pricing, con pricing is tested anywhere about any product but uh, maybe for your own learning because when it comes to the security product not everything is free there is something the budget need to be there and you need to communicate to the customer but that's how i believe you can easily take your time make your own plan and you may you may need to refer something like the some kind of especially a terminology terminology like let's say icmp flood attack or sin flood or udp flood if you are not aware about that maybe use your favorite search engine figure out learn the basic and then the clarity about this exam and uh, all the best subscribe to my channel and share it with your circle so that we are, all can learn together take care